What are you doing? Get out. Please, now let's just try another. Try one. what? Try what? What can, what can you do? What can you do? Oh, that was just to satisfy me. You cannot satisfy me. After making mouth, I will do this to you. I will take you to a planet. Wait, what, what planet have you taken me to? Just relax. Let's... Uncle, carry your things and go. I don't want to do it again. The energy is here now. Wait, just and, wait, 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 is it round two you want to satisfy? This one will be better. Be better Trust for what? I gave you something to take. You cannot still do nothing. Okay, go. We go in, we go in. Okay, okay, okay. We go in, we go in. Get out. Are you sure you don't want another one? Want, want another one from you? Look at this man. Wait, I said get out. Better. Which better? You cannot do anything. You cannot satisfy. Come on to satisfy a woman. You cannot do. That's best impression. Now this one will be. Oh, please go. I don't want your lasting impression. Get out. Leave. Let's try. Leave. 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 Go. 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 Try. Try what? Try. Let, let, let's try. Mommy, mommy, it's three seconds, man. You can do anything. You are just stop. Big man, periwinkle size. Sweet, I don't even know why I called this time waster. Wasted my time doing nothing. Katya scattered the whole bed. Somebody see this bed like this, they will think, oh, somebody has, he has done something mighty. Hey! You need deliverance. Go go and pray for deliverance. Go ask somebody to deliver you. Because you cannot satisfy a woman. Expectations. Nothing. This is my phone, I beg. Let me call Austin. Austin is better than him. Hey, Austin. Long time. <laughs> I, I enjoyed myself. I had so much fun. You did? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm glad you did. This is just the tip of the iceberg. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh you are silly. Very well. What about you? What are the things you are doing? <laughs> stop it, stop it, stop it. Okay, um, so take care of yourself, okay? I will. Miranda. Yeah. I think I want to see you again tonight. What do you think? Um. Sure. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll call you. All right. That's beautiful. Uh, okay. See you. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Uh, take care of yourself. Okay? You too. Uh, okay. Bye. <laughs> <sighs> Miranda, what is even wrong with you? When will you stop changing men like rapper? Ain't you tired of this reckless lifestyle? What are you doing? What? I only ask what you're doing. I'm trying to upload a video on my blog page. A woman caught her husband cheating on her with another girl on their matrimonial bed. 
Are you serious? Hmm. Ah, ah. Hmm. Men will always be men. Wait, 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 this one. Yes. Ah! The man is handsome. He's so cute. Wow. Look at his six packs. Wow, this is definitely my spec. Miranda. What? Ah, uh ah. -uh. Yosef, look, look, turn and look, look at it. Is this man not fine? Ah, ah, look at this. Look, look very. Look at his packs. Ah, so he's fine. It's just so yummy, you know. Looks so good. Miranda, get over your hot pants. You need Jesus. Okay. Ah. Mm. Okay. <laughs> But it's not bad though, if you see the truth, you say, look at him, look at the man, he is fine. The man is handsome, he has everything. Look at the, the, the you know what, once you're done with your work, like your laptop, just let me know because I need to visit that site. I need to invite this man over here because he needs to be punished. Daddy has been a naughty boy. I can't wait to bring down the roof of this house. <laughs> Miranda. <laughs> oh, it's so hot in here. You are so beautiful, Miranda. Look. I really love and care about you. Since I met you, I have not been able to take you out of my head. I am mesmerized by your beauty. The way you carry yourself with respect and class amazes me. The way you walk, everything about you makes me realize how much I want to be with you. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I want to marry you. Um, uh -huh. Come on, David. Um, I'm married already. I know. But I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I can't possibly leave my husband for you. Uh, look, you're a good man. I like you and that's why I'm allowing this thing to kind of flourish. But we're just having fun. No strings attached, no commitment whatsoever. Let's... Let's just have fun. Let's stick to this. Okay? I'm committed to my husband. This means nothing. But um, David, I I have to go. My my husband. David, listen, listen, my husband. My husband is at home. Don't worry. I'll call you some other time, okay? I'll call I'll call you, okay? So excited. What is it? <laughs> ah, you won't believe.
believe what happens today. <laughs> okay. I'm listening. <laughs> wow, this guy. This guy. <laughs> this dude was professing love to me. <laughs> Can you imagine? I love you. I, I, I can get you off my head. Blah, 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 blah. Can you imagine the nonsense? This stupid guy wants to use serious relationship to hook me down, though. <laughs> and what did you tell him? What else? I told him I'm married and can't be committed to a man. Miranda, why do you keep pushing all men in your life? Why do you keep parading yourself with these rings? Oh, Elsie, I've said this severally. I cannot be committed to any man. Ah! See, I don't have time for marriage, you. As in, marriage is so overrated. Yes! Besides, it's not bad to use a little deception on these men. Wait, let me ask you. Why would a sensible man want to be with a married woman? It's simple. People want what they can't have. There's no strings attached and nobody gets hurt. I'm just having fun. It's fun. You call all this having fun? Okay. Fine, it's understandable that you don't want a committed relationship. That's fine. But at least you should stop having sex with different men. Pick one. Uh, have sex with one man. I beg, I beg. No, 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 no. Don't even go there. Don't. Please. Eh? Which one? Please, one man is not enough for me. At all. At all. Ah. Oh, okay, wait, 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 wait. So if I decide to, like, settle down today, then tomorrow I meet someone I like more, as in my main spec. What then do I do? Miranda. With these, this men think you're married. You know that. Can you just stop it? As in, stop it already. I've had, I've had it soon here. Please, stop it. Haba. Someone can even have fun in peace again. Okay, you, 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 wait, wait, you, you that claim to be all decent and organized. Who has settled down with you? Haba, give me my ring. Give me my rings. Give me, just give them to me. Give them to me. Ah. Give me my I rings. I know you know the right thing. You need to stop. And you know it. Miss Morality. I'm only telling you the truth. I don't want to hear the truth.
get a series. <laughs> Okay. Um, Nick, let's go. Let us go. You are naughty, 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 naughty. <laughs> What? What is it? Why do you always give me that look anytime you see me with a man? Why won't I look at you? Miranda, why won't I look at you? I mean, you should have heard yourself screaming like a loose cannon. <coughs> you heard my soundtrack? <coughs> FC, that guy is good. <sighs> placed me in different positions, like he gave it to me from the back, Ooh, gave it to me from the front. Ah! He, he took me to cloud nine, took me to cloud ten, he gave it to me, you know, there was a star, he gave it to me, and I was like, ah! I couldn't, I didn't want him to stop. He handled me with so much care, he knew the places to touch. I kept begging him to give it to me more and more and more. And Miranda, you don't have shame. And to think you don't have a height of respect for men. Sweetheart, I know of men using women, but in your case, I have to give it to you. If you like, don't come out of your shell and start having fun. Keep staying here like an old woman. I know what you need. You need a good sex. You need to feel a man's touch, you know? You need to feel his lips on your neck. Oh, on your lips. Ugh. When you experience a good sex, then you will know how it feels for different men to clean out your cobwebs. I give up. <laughs> You're a real case. Miranda, you are a case study. I need to study you. Because this ain't my friend. So you finally decided to call me? I'm busy. Okay. I was only calling you to check up on you. What about what we talked about? I'm not coming. Why? Jonathan, I already told you, Miranda is a nice person. Look, she's far from being nice. That girl doesn't have an eye of respect for men. And that makes me very uncomfortable. Attitude disgusts me. In fact, she's, she's a peeve. You're talking like you're coming to see Miranda. It's me you're coming to see. Her lifestyle is none of your business. I'm only saying this because I've missed you. Come and see your sister now. I have missed you, and you know that. Okay, I will drop by tomorrow to see you. But I won't sleep over. <gasps> We'll talk later, okay? I have to go to bed now. I'm so tired. Good night.
Good morning. Good morning. You look so beautiful. Are you going to see a man? Listen, my life doesn't revolve around men. I'm a career woman and I have a meeting with a client. Okay? Please, I'm running late for my meeting. I beg you to see me. Uh, um, that reminds me, Jonathan said he's coming. Okay, my regards to him when he comes. Some pounds. This is that the hustle. I'll grab this one. I've yeah, been a gentleman. How are Welcome. You? you look good. You look really good. Like this. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, what's <laughs> the problem now? Welcome. <laughs> Thank you very much. How's everything? Fine, fine, fine. Your boss. Okay, don't worry about this. Hey, I'm only being a good sister. I know. I know. <laughs> I've really missed your troubles. <laughs> I hear you. Look, this food is very delicious. Let me go to lie. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Hmm. You've lost some pounds, though. How <laughs> don't I lose weight? I think it's easy to be hustling every day under the hot, scorching sun looking for work. It's normal now. The hustle is real. But at least you still need to look sexy. <laughs> very funny. Who's oh, sexy, Ep? This is money I'm looking for. When money comes and then we can think about sex. Oh, mm. Where's your inmate? I haven't seen her since I came. She went for a meeting, but she'll soon be back. She has a meeting with a client. Okay, my client. What? Did I say anything? I, I hope you're here to stay. Yes, we already had this conversation over the phone. All right, I can't stay here. I'm starting my house hunting tomorrow, and if by tomorrow I'm unable to find anything, I'll just go and stay with Chike. Why? Why would you stay with Chike when I have a place where you can easily stay? And why are you asking questions you already know the answer to? I cannot stay here. I don't have strength for Miranda and her promiscuous lifestyle. You know, it gets on my nerves. I can't stand this. Please, don't come and add to my already existing stress. But Miranda is not your problem. You are here to stay with me. You don't need to start paying for, for house. I mean, if you're here, your feeding is on me, so you get to save some money sis, at least. Sis, sis, please, can I just eat this food in peace? Hmm? We are done having this conversation. I'm not staying. Uncle Hoha. No, you will force me now. Mm. You will force me. Put the gun to my head and force me to stay. I will do that. Okay, now. We will see. Oh, I'll take the food. When I'm leaving, you hold my belt. Yes. Okay. Hi, brother. The guest room is ready. So when you want to sleep, you can go in. I'm only staying for the night. I already told you I don't plan on staying here for long. Jonathan, you are talking like someone is pushing you away. When you want to sleep, you go to the guest room. Okay? Jonathan. 
who is he? Brother in law. Jonathan, what are you doing here? Are you sure we should be here? I mean, he's your brother in law. What if he tells his brother, your husband? We have an understanding, don't we? Don't worry, let's go. Madam, why didn't you tell me your brother would be sleeping over? I don't understand. Is that why you bashed into my room? I don't care. You should have at least informed me that Jonathan would be sleeping over. You made me look like a she-goat in heat last night. I was utterly embarrassed. But I told you that he's coming to see me. So? Did you tell me he would be sleeping over? I thought it was his usual visit. Wait, hold on. What is this force about? What happened? You came home with a man last night? Miranda. It's fine if you don't have any respect for yourself. But I live here too. At least you need to start respecting me. If you've forgotten, we share the rent. This house is my house as much as it's yours. If you want to sleep with every man in town, okay. Get a room. A hotel. Stop bringing in strange men into this house. I don't like it. And for your information, Jonathan is here to stay. What? Yes! You heard me. My brother is here to stay. And don't even think of going close to him. Because obviously you go after everything in trousers. What do I want to do with your brother? Mm. What can he offer me? Mm. His presence alone is a turn off. Okay, I've heard you. Next time, please knock, because I'm not going to entertain that. Oh, God. Father, I am sorry. Come on, faces. I am married. I, I can't be in a serious relationship with you. That's all I want is fun. Look, I can't be committed to 
another man other than my husband. Let's, let's just flow with the vibes, okay? No commitments, no love, just two people satisfying themselves. <laughs> Actually, that I come over to your place. Yeah, you, you are naughty, naughty, naughty. You know how I love it. <laughs> Yeah, from the back. Oh, oh my goodness, you are. Oh. Hey. Which can I be this one? How is single dick like sex past anything, past food? Every time, sex, 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 sex. Interception. Hey! Oh, David, it's you. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Just waiting for my Uber to arrive. Oh, okay, I see. Uh, come in, let me talk to you. Okay, hope no problem. No, 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 no. It's about your friend Miranda. Okay. Alright. Thank you. My Uber was taking so long to come. Oh, I'm sorry thank you about so that. Much. Thank you so much for the ride. You're welcome. My Uber was actually taking too long. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. It's okay. It's fine. Yeah. It's about your friend Miranda. Okay, what about? You see, I've been calling her soon, but she's not taking my calls. I really love your friend. And I want to make her mine at all costs. Do you really love her that much? Very much. Yeah. I want to make her my wife. That is, if she agrees to divorce her husband and move with me. Okay. I will, I will try and talk to her. That's all I can say. You know, at the end of the day, she's, she's her own person. So I'll just talk to her and know what she will say about it. She has the final say. Thank you very much. I will be waiting for your feedback. It's okay. It's fine. So, I drop you. Yeah, sure. Thank you so much. <laughs> you really saved the day, guys. I mean, the sun it's was so time. hot. It's not time. It's not time. <laughs> Who was there? 
Come in. Babe. I wanted to discuss with you earlier, but I couldn't say anything because Jonathan was there. Okay. Um, what is it? I saw David today. Why are, you, why are you having that look on your face? Miranda, that guy loves you. He said he's ready to get married to you. I mean, that is rare to find in this age. Nowadays, men don't want to settle down. But this guy has seen beyond your deceit and he says he wants to marry you. Exactly. That is my problem with him. He wants commitment and I can't give him that. You see, I'm not even ready for anything called settling down. I don't want it. Me and love, we are worlds apart. I don't need, I don't want to settle down. I'm not, I'm not a love person. Please. That is because you've not given love a chance. Babe, this guy is rich. He's handsome. What exactly do you want? He will provide anything you want. You. I don't want anything. You don't want anything. <laughs> Elsie, I have had a long day today and I need to rest. Please leave my room. You're asking me to leave your room. You heard me. Please leave. Miranda, you're my best friend. If any other person will lie to you, I will not lie to you. This, this path you're towing, it's not a good one and it will definitely Elsie, not... Elsie, Elsie! I'll say good night. Good night, please. Okay, I'm, I'm not here to fight you. It's okay. I'm, I'm just, I'm just trying to say that. Okay. Okay. No issues. Good night. What's up, bro? <laughs> You've been moody since we got here. Are you okay? First of all, my heart is breaking into pieces. Come on, we both know that no woman can break your heart. So tell me, what's the problem? First of there is this lady I met. <laughs> you need to see this girl. She's so pretty. <laughs> We've had sex on several occasions and all I wanted was just fun. Likewise, a guy. I don't fall in love with this girl. And I want to make her my wife at all costs. I love this girl. This is actually the first time you're being serious about a woman. So, what's stopping you from proposing to her? That is the problem. She is married. You see? Yes. She is married, and she said she does not want any commitment or serious relationship. Can you just imagine? She said that to you? Well, um, I met a girl that I love so much. I tried proposing to her, but she called me a bluff. But what is wrong with these girls of nowadays? You never can tell. Miranda, you need to see this girl guy. The name Coca-Cola shape like this. It's getting into my head, guy. Hold on. What did you just say? Miranda. I love this girl. Do you have a picture? Why won't I? Yes, sure. Can I see? What? You, you, you mean? 
she's the one I was talking about. Are you serious right now? This can only mean one thing. What? Won't you at least say something to me? Come on. Fine, I'm sorry. I was way out of line. I'm sorry about last night. I shouldn't have asked you to leave the way I did. Lucy, I'm sorry. I promise it won't happen again. Come on, Bestie. I'm so sorry. Just say something, please. You know I don't like it when you're mad at me. Sorry. Look, Miranda. The only reason I interfere in your business, or it seems like I'm poking my nose in your business, is because I actually love and care about you. If I don't, trust me, I won't even interfere. I want what's best for you. That's why I'm saying something. Oh, I feel so special already. Okay, I truly, truly appreciate you wanting what's best for me. But please, you need to stop worrying yourself about me. I got this. Elsie, this is what I want. This is my life. This is who I am and I need you to accept it. I can't be in a serious relationship. I can't love genuinely. It won't work. All I want is fun. Okay. I've heard you. I won't say anything about it anymore. Mm. I mean, you're an adult. You know what's best for you. So, all I want for you is to just be careful. That's all. I am careful. Miranda, be careful. I am careful, Miss Carefulness. Okay. All right. Hug it in. What? Hug it in. Is that one of my Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It's okay, boo. I'm really sorry. What? I, I know you. <laughs> I have someone to show you. <laughs> so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. He is so cute. I have to show you. You're my best friend. I can't show any other person. So here you go. Look. His name is Ferdinand, and we are hooking up tonight. Mm. Um, isn't he cute? He is. Mm -hmm. But why is he sound like that? He's a model. Uh, I think I'm into models now, like... Uh, sorry, just... I'm not gonna distract you again, just continue walking. Okay? Miranda. Bless it. Please. Fine. I'm just joking. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, but he is cute. Wait, come to think of it. What? How are you coping? Like, you're just there. You're not seeing anyone. No one is coming to see you. You're just... I really wonder how Lambda is doing. Miranda, same way you asked me to mind my business. Please mind yours. Mm? Thank you. Uh, <clears throat> Apropos. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. 
Mm. Mm. Oh, I got this for us actually. So this just is my apology. Orange. <laughs> You, my sis. Here you go. I'm treating you like a queen. That you are. What is wrong with this girl? <laughs> okay. Hold on, I'm coming. One minute. Hold on. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Who are you? Is Jonathan home? No, you are. I'm Chiki, Jonathan's friend. Oh, okay. okay. Um, Elsie, his sister. I know. Man. They talked about you. Um, actually, Jonathan is at his office. He's not at home. I thought he was going to be at home already. No, 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 he's not. Then I guess I have to go see him at the office instead. Okay, perfect. All right, I'll take my leave now. Sure, no problem. Bye. Bye. What's all this now? What's this? Oh, face to tell me to meet him here and he's nowhere to be found. This. Why would you tell me to meet you here? You and you, what was this? You just kept me here. I'm very sorry, okay. Um, actually, I wanted us to talk in a private place. David, do you really think you can, you can make a fool out of us and go scot free? You deceived us about being married. Just come down. All you wanted from us was just sex. No, no. Sex. Look, I, I, I can explain. I promise you. It's not what you think. Just let's look for some way to talk about this. It's not what you think. Please, let's just... Shut up your mouth. You're nothing but a whore. All you do is change men like rappers. <laughs> just to satisfy your sexual urge. Just, just calm down. I, 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 can you just... Women like you do not deserve a man's love. You're nothing but a loose dog. That is what you are. A she-goat in heat. For knowing your friend, she's probably somewhere making out with some random guy. No, this is not about making out with anybody. I know. Miranda! Miranda! Are you okay? Wait, let's, let's take her inside. Miranda, what happened to you? Easy, easy, easy. <laughs> Miranda! Let's bring her stuff. <laughs> Miranda! What happened? Do you really think you can, you can make a fool out of us and go scot-free? <laughs> you deceived us about being married. 
why you want it from us with your sex? No, it's not what you're thinking. It's just Shut up your mouth! You're nothing but a whore. All you do is change men like rappers. <laughs> just to satisfy your sexual urge. Just, just calm down. I, 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 Can you just... Just sh shut up. Women like you do not deserve a man's love. You're nothing but a loose dog. That is what you are. A she got in heat. How is she doing? Has she said anything? Have you even seen her this morning? I have not. I don't know what the problem is. I hope she just cries up when she comes downstairs. Well, let's just let's keep our fingers crossed. Yeah. We're not worried. It's okay. Yeah. I know she'll be fine. Definitely. So tell me, who did this to you? David. What? David. David and Festus did this to me. I don't, I, I don't understand. I'm, 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 I'm confused. I thought David was in love with you. What did you do for them to do this to you? What did you do to them? They found out. They found out I've been lying about being married. Miranda, I want you. I tried to tell you all this, but you didn't listen to me. Now look at you. I 
tried several times to talk to you, but babe, you were not listening. I told you that your lies will catch up with you. Now just, just, just look at what these people did to you. I should have known better. I should have. But I can't get over what happened to my mother in the past. How she loved my father with every fiber of her being. But what did he do to her? He cheated on her, took all her life savings, and absconded with another woman. That's the reason I can't give love a chance. I understand. <laughs> but at least this will serve as a lesson. Not all men are like your father. There are still good men out there. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's okay. You see, you said I don't deserve any man's love. Am I that bad? Don't I deserve to be loved? You're not bad at all. You're not even this close to being bad. You can't receive what you don't give. It's all in here. You need to be ready to accept love before it comes to you. You need to start seeing sex and fun in a different way. That's the only way love can come to you. You're not bad. So yes, you will see someone that will love you. I am sure. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay, come. I'm tired. I'm tired. It's alright. It's okay. It's alright. Sorry. Do you want me to get hot? Sorry, do you want me to get hot water? When you're listening to blues this morning, are we safe? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I I have finally decided to listen to your advice. Baby girl wants to find love. I want to meet somebody, fall in love, and settle down. And love will locate you. Amen. I pray for you today, my sister. Mm. You will see a man that will love you for who you are. I receive it. A Prince Charming. Mm. 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 Amen. As you go out today, a man will locate you. Amen. A man that will love you unconditionally. Amen. Should I continue? Yes, continue. You are going to meet a man that will love you. Amen. He will love your past and your present. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, 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 please. Ah. Eh, present, yes, but past, no. Past is past. There's no need for him to know anything about my past. My dear, every relationship that needs a solid foundation starts with honesty. Mm -hmm. So you have to tell him the truth. If he loves you, he's going to love your past and your present. I mean, you're not who you are now, so... Well, it's behind me, so it's pointless bringing it up. Mm. Yes. Mm. I'm like, I'm like, wait, 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 Hold on, there's somebody I want to show you. Hold on. Just... What do you think about him? You, you've seen one already? Uh, not really. It's just, it's just somebody I'm talking to. Nothing serious. Mm. He seemed modest and he respects me from the way we talk. 
Huh. And the boy know. is fine now. <laughs> but uh, I just pray he's not a jerk. I don't even know. I'm just... I'm trying to be hopeful. Give us a shot, baby girl. Oh, see, fingers crossed. Mm. Honestly, fingers mm. crossed. <laughs> Please. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Uh, but no, 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 no. I'm, I'm quite nervous. He, he wants us to meet up tonight and I don't know. I'm just... Nervous I don't know about it's what? Going to I don't know now. I don't know what to expect. Talking like it's your first time going on a date. Sweetheart, if I'm going to be accurate, it's more than a thousand. So what exactly are you scared of? Oh, please stop. You, you understand what I'm talking about? I'm right? telling the truth now. But this one is serious. It's different from the other dates. What makes it different? Are you going oh, sorry, to... Sorry, sorry, okay, sorry. See, okay, what I want for you is to at least just help me select what to wear. I don't want to dress inappropriately. Your chauffeur is at your service. <laughs> Madam. <laughs> Let me just round off this. Thing sure. we'll Take your airpods, please. I don't want you to say I. I, I Thank I, I you. It. Let me it's keep not enjoying hard. my. What do you want me to help songs. you and do? Sorry. What do you want me to help you and do? Just tell me select what to wear, please. Which color? I don't know. Anyone that's just whatever you think. I really don't like black. We do blue. <laughs> whatever you want. Sky blue. Leave me, please. Turquoise blue. <laughs> With a, a touch of peach green. <laughs> Trust me, girl. I prepared for you too. Hey, babes. How was your day? I didn't show up.
When are you coming back? Next weekend. Okay. Tell mom and dad I'll consider. <laughs> I will. I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. I'll see you soon. Sure. Where are you going to? Where does it look like I'm going? I'm money leads. Let me help you with the No, don't worry. Let me slide some. I'll miss you. I will miss you too. No, I'll see you soon, eh? <laughs> okay. I didn't have you before you come. I'll come see mom and dad. Okay. okay. Feel better. You're welcome. Thank you. Um, I was so, so dehydrated. I know. Thank you. <laughs> You're better now. Yes. So let's jump some more. Huh? Mm -hmm. oh. Come on. <laughs> let's go. Come on. Try, 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 try. So I'm Eric. I'm Miranda. Miranda. Nice meeting you. Yes. It's like you're new here. I mean, in the neighborhood. Uh, that was the first time seeing you jog here. That was actually my first time jogging, but I'm not new. I live a few blocks away. Really? Mm -hmm. So tell me, why did you decide to jog today? I guess I needed some air and a little distraction. Distraction? <laughs> no, don't worry yourself. It's personal stuff. Okay, so what do you do? I, I, I'm in serial estate. And you look like a model. <laughs> <laughs> no. I was expecting you to say you're a model. No. Really? <laughs> what do you do? Oh, well, I'm into entertainment. Oh, nice. nice. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Thank you. than winning a jackpot. Elsie, I think I met him. Ah! I met him. I met the man I want to spend the rest of my life with. Yes. Really? Yes, I met my soulmate. My better half. The man that walked me to the altar and say, yes, I do. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health, till death is the worst part. Girl, come tell me about him. <laughs> I'm going to ship this. Wait, his name is Eric. Um, how we met? It was like a Disney love story. I, I, I was, I was jogging, jogging and jogging. Then I got extremely tired and dehydrated. Then this handsome man, my knight in shining armor, walked up to me and said, 
take. Have some water and you will feel better. Baby, <laughs> baby, it was like Nancy Myers. Romantic stage of meat cute. <laughs> that sounds so romantic. I know. <sighs> oh, catch some breath. <laughs> I'm just so excited. This guy is, he's like, he's, he's, a, he's a perfect gentleman. He's, he's everything. I, you know, seeing him, I just, I felt it. I, I felt the connection. It's like, we're meant for each other. Like, you know, the way, the way he speaks, his eyes, his, his smile, like the spark in his eyes when he smiles, it's everything. Ah! <laughs> you are as much as I'm happy for you. How would you know he's the right person? I mean, what if he's married? I know. Nah, nope, nope. He's not married, nope. There wasn't a ring on his finger. Are you sure? Oh! Oh, God. It's calling. Shh. <coughs> Hi. Hello. I guess you will know. Oh, yes. I just arrived and uh, I want to take my shower then. Head up to work. <laughs> That's nice. Uh, I'll do the same too. It's okay. You know, I really would like to see you again. Uh, no, I, I don't mind. I would, I would love to. I would love us to see you. Really? So why don't we meet um, later this evening? That is, if you don't mind. <laughs> Hello. Hello, are you are you there? Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. Yes, I am. I <laughs> I don't mind having dinner with you. It's okay. All right, then I'll, I'll text you the the venue later tonight. All right? Seven p.m. Okay. Bye. See you later. to know more about you. <laughs> wow. Well, there's nothing much to know. <laughs> fine, <laughs> fine, okay. Um, I'm 29, a graduate of Lagos State University. I read hotel management and I'm currently a real estate broker. Wow. <laughs> cool. Hopefully in the near future I'll be needing your services. Definitely. <laughs> you should. <laughs> um, what about you? Are you married, in a relationship, or single? Well, I'll start by um, telling you where I work. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I work in a telecommunication company and um, an entertainer as well. I'm 35 years old. I'm not married. I'm not in any relationship for now. I was in a relationship, but not anymore. Uh, um, if you don't mind me asking, what happened to your previous relationship? Well, she cheated on me and um, on my best friend. Oh. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. 
uh, I've moved on. I mean, the both of us have moved on. So, back to you. Are you married? <laughs> Never been married. <laughs> oh, thank God. Thank God. <laughs> so, any relationship? Nope. Single. But wait, why are you thanking God I'm not married? Are you happy a girl my age is still unmarried? Come on, that's unfair. No, I don't want you that's to. Unfair. No, I don't want you to take it the wrong way, okay? I mean. I'm just being happy that at least I have a chance because um, I'm a bachelor, a chronic bachelor in search of a love of his life. So who knows? Or you may just be the, the woman I've been searching for in my life. You're a sweet stalker. And I love your nails. <laughs> <laughs> so beautiful. Thank you. Wow. Look good. Can you smile again? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Welcome to my home. Wow. Thank goodness. Ah, you have a beautiful house. I love the interior. I love everything. Thank you very much. Thank you. Just make yourself comfortable, okay? Thank you. I mean, Wait. Yeah. Is that you? Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 
You looked so cute when you were younger. Oh yes, actually I took that picture when I was just 10 years old. My mom said I was about going to watch Masquerade in the X-Men season. <laughs> <laughs> what happened now? Like, What are you trying to say? Are you trying to say that I, I, I look ugly now? Is that what you're trying to say? Come on, just take a good look at me. I'm always cute. I'm no, still cute. Compared to this, nah, you looked way, way cuter when you were younger. <laughs> oh, well, I'll take that as a compliment anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, you really have a lovely apartment. I truly wasn't expecting all of this. I mean, you know, men don't usually have a good taste when it comes to interior. Oh, well, I do. <laughs> <laughs> you do, actually. I really do. Come on, make yourself comfortable once yeah, again. Thank you. Yeah. So, um, what do I offer you? Um, anything? Anything. Yeah, anything. Huh. So, I'll get you anything. <laughs> <laughs> Just a minute, I'll be right back, okay? Thank you. It was really nice spending time with you. Yeah, me too. I love spending time with my boyfriend. I love you so much. I love you too. Good night. Good night. Jonathan, are you sure you're okay at your friend's place? You know you can always come back home. Nobody chased you away. <sighs> okay. What of Chiki? My regards to him. Okay, I'm going to call you tomorrow, okay? I'll call you tomorrow. Bye. Hey. Miranda, what is it? You don't look happy. I'm okay. I'm fine. Did you have a fight with Eric? No. We are good. Then what is it? Because the expression on your face tells otherwise. Elsie, I'm honey. I need a man's touch. I don't understand. I thought Eric already asked you to be his girlfriend. That's the problem. We are dating, but Eric isn't making a move. I, I want him to touch me. I want him to make me feel like a woman. But he's just not noticing me sexually. I want him. I need to feel the warmth of his body. Wow. But you should be happy about it. Happy about what? Elsie, I have not had sex in two months. Good two months. And you are telling me to be happy. What is there to be happy? You know, this is the reason I hate being committed to men. So you want someone that will use and dump you? Is that what you want? Miranda, relationship is not all about sex. Besides, I, I, I think the, the relationship is still very much new for you guys to be intimate with each other. Don't you think so? At least now, just something small, like, let's, let's make a little move, just at least a kiss, nothing. Maybe he's trying to take it slow. Tabra, 
taking things slow doesn't mean that we shouldn't get romantic. Like, just do something small, a kiss, little touches here. Don't do the mean thing. Just, I don't even know I'm talking to you. It's just of no use. It's fine. Just move with his pace. If he wants to take things slow, then that's fine. Okay? Is that why you're frowning? Miranda. No, no, no. <laughs> Girlfriend, is it's not a big deal. And, and look, at least now, it's because we're taking things slow, doesn't mean that we shouldn't get involved. Like, just a little. This is only talking to you, Seth. I'm just tired. I don't even know why I brought Give this him to you. time. Give him time. How long? How long? It's been two months already. How many more? Should I give him years? Like 10 years? Ah. Miranda. Um, what are you doing? Trying to get a job done. Oh. Babe. <laughs> I know you have always wanted me to touch you. I feel super attracted to you. Very, very attracted to you. But I love you so much. And what I want from you is more than sex. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. All this will happen when we get married, after we're married.
thank you so much for being my best friend. For always giving me the right advice. I love you, my dear friend. I love you. What are you looking for? My token. Your token? Yes. Are you sure you brought it with you? I did, I did. I I don't just know why I kept it. Have you checked your bag? Yeah, I have, but I didn't find it there. Sure. Did you pick it up or something? Because I don't even know where to look for it again. Are you married? Are you married? And what is a wedding ring doing in your bag? Why did you lie to me? I have been honest with you. <laughs> so I have been having an affair with a married woman. And you didn't tell me. I ask again. Are you married? <laughs> are you married? Yes. No, 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 no. no. Yes, yes, yes. We're getting a divorce, okay? We're getting a divorce, okay? It's not working. He hits me, he hits me at every slightest opportunity. How could I tell you that I was married to a beast? I couldn't. I'm sorry, I'm sorry I didn't tell you the truth, but it's you I want. It's you I love, it's not him. It's over, the marriage is over. It's... We will get in the divorce, okay, please. I'm sorry, I... I'm sorry I didn't tell you the truth. I'm sorry, but he hates me. And you want me to believe all the stories? Huh? I swear to you, be very honest. Be, be please, I've been honest with you, babe. Be please. <laughs> you tell him the truth? I didn't, I didn't know when the words came out of my mouth. I, I was scared. When I saw him holding the ring, it, it was as if, as if my whole world was crushing right before me. You see, I couldn't tell him I was using the ring to avoid being committed to men. I love Eric so much. I can't live without him. I can't let my past ruin the future I have with him. You really love him, don't you? Yes. I love him. 
him so much. I haven't felt this way for any man before. You see, I can't afford to lose Eric. I really can't. him. I just want you to be honest next time. Once you tell him the truth, you won't lose him. Okay? If you're honest, lines will fall at pleasant places for you. I'm sure. No, don't, don't do that. You know I don't want to see you cry. It's okay. Okay, it's fine. Okay. I want to meet your husband. What? Yes, I want to meet a stupid and uncultured man that beats up his wife. Why? Why? If, if my husband finds out about our relationship, it will be difficult for the court to grant our divorce. Why? It's not like there was a prenup and an infidelity clause to it. No, 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 but, but he still loves me, but I don't. So if he finds out about us, it will be difficult for us to, to have the divorce. I'm the one filing for the divorce. If you truly want this relationship to work, I must meet your husband. Okay? Besides, what's his name? Jo 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 Jonathan. No. No, I said no, I can't do it. I will not do it. Why, why did you even mention my name? How did you even think of my name? Of all the names in the world, it had to be my name, Jonathan. Come on! Jonathan, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I mentioned your name. I know I shouldn't have, but I'm sorry. I, I didn't have a choice. I don't know what else to do. You, you're my only option, Jonathan. Please, I, I, really, I really love Eric. Please, I need to save my relationship. Well, if you love this guy as much as you claim you do, why don't you just come clean? Just come get yourself. I don't want to be involved in, in your lies and deceits. Please don't, don't drag me to your messed up life. What kind of rubbish is this? Please, for the sake of our relationship, please help her. No, Nancy, I can't. I can't do it. Come on, listen to yourself. Do you even realize what she's saying? Okay, let's even assume that I'm willing to pretend to be someone's husband or married to someone. Not, not Miranda now. Come on. Uh, of all people, someone had, that has uh, littered her temple. Uh -uh. Jonathan, do you really hate me that much? I hate what you do with every fiber in my being. I hate it so much. Look, both of you clearly don't have anything important to say, so me and you. I'll give you 500,000.
We are good to go. Okay, we are good. I'm just waiting for Eric. He said he's almost here. Okay. I, <laughs> I am tense. Okay. He's here. I'll go get the door. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll tell Jonathan. friend Eric. Eric, my husband. <laughs> nice meeting you. I've heard a lot about you. Well, it's good to meet you too and I hope they are nice things. Oh, definitely nice things. <laughs> nice meeting you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <clears throat> Sweetheart, you didn't, uh, you didn't introduce uh, Elsie. Oh, so sorry. Um, this is Elsie, Jonathan's sister. She lives here with us. Really? Nice meeting you as well. Nice to meet you too. Elsie, right? Yes. <laughs> well, Mr. Eric, why don't you make yourself comfortable? Uh, yeah. Thank you. And if you don't mind, I'd like to borrow my wife for a few moments if it's not too much trouble. So. Uh, Come, babe. We'll be back. So what now? Because this is getting more difficult than I thought. Come on, if this man really loves you, then why, why does he want to meet your husband? I don't know. Believe me, I don't like any of this. What would you have me do? I can't afford to lose him. I love him. Okay, I have an idea, all right? Why don't we pretend to have a, a fight, a, a, an argument, a, a huge one, loud one to his hearing. If he hears us arguing, then he will believe that we are a very unhappy couple. What do you think? Okay, okay, okay. I, I, I think that's good. How do, we, how do we go about it? Just follow my lead, okay? So, listen, you have to tell me the reason why you brought a man into my house and you have to tell me now. Oh, so I can't invite somebody to this house anymore? Oh, okay, so that, that, that's what you're saying. Now it makes perfect sense. It makes perfect sense why you wanted to get a divorce because of this man. It's because of him. Jonathan, do not even go there. You know, I'm getting a divorce. Is that how the quarrel? Yes. But one thing I'm certain of is that my brother loves Miranda. I'm 100% sure. I am not so you not work out of me. I am talking to you. Don't work out of me when I'm talking to you. Sorry about. Uh, is everything okay? Yeah, everything is fine. <laughs> Let's just go have dinner, okay? Uh, this way, sir. Let's pray then. Let's hold hands. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.
know, your, your husband was nice to me. I mean, very nice. I mean, looking at him, he seems so nice. But Indus is a wife, Peter. I'm just glad you've seen it for yourself. When we're in front of people, he acts all goody two shoes. But when we're home, he does the craziest things. He's a belligerent and a narcissistic, to say the least. I just can't wait for the court to finalize this divorce issue. I just can't wait to have you in my arms. Me too. I can't wait to get out of this sham I call marriage. I love you so much. I love you too. No, 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 don't, 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 don't worry, I got this. Are you sure? Yes, and thank you so much for your little idea. I really can't believe it for you unhappy. I mean, it's my job. You pay me for it, so I might as well put in the effort, right? Mm-hmm, right. <laughs> well, let me ask you something. Why are you really doing this? Like, do you really love this guy? Because the Miranda that I know would not want to commit to any man. <sighs> yes. I really love him and if I could turn back the ends of time I would definitely correct my past and start all over again but I can't well what is important is that you are alive and you're going the extra mile for the one you love that I must applaud you for so keep it up <laughs> thank you Please don't worry about this mess. I'll clean it up. Please. Are you sure you don't you don't need any help? No, I'm good. Go get some rest. You've done enough already. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, for for what is worth, I think that both of you will make a great couple. Thank you. Yeah, I'm I'm happy for you that you found love. Please just don't mess it up. Okay, sir. I promise I won't. <laughs> Please go get some rest. Okay. Hello. All right. Uh, careful. Uh, what's going on? Please, can you just help me? Mm -mm.
No, 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 I didn't cheat. You cheated? No, no, you cheated? No, no, I was, you cheated? No, I didn't. You were supposed to call me. Yeah, which I did. No, you did no, not. I, I did not hear I, you. you that was not the argument. No, 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 no I, was, I was looking for you. <laughs> no! How's Eric? He's good. Uh, why do you ask? Miranda, are you... Are you sure this guy really loves you? Why would you say that? Eric loves me. A lot. I mean, you, you, just, you just have to be sure because I feel like you're doing too much for him. I mean, offering me 500k just to act like your soon-to-be divorced husband. I am very sure that's why I'm doing all this to make our relationship work. Well, you want me to find out how he really feels? What are you doing? Shh. Eric is coming. Um, can, you, can you just stop this already? Stop! Jonas, I'm, I'm tired of this marriage. Stop it! Do I not deserve at least a kiss before you run off with your Prince Charming? What, what are you... Do you know how I feel? Do you know how that made me feel? Do you? Do I detect a hint of jealousy in the tone of your voice?
we are the only ones that have got 10 points in my family. Oh, really? But she's got two. I've only got one. She actually really had one before. She's growing on the other one came out. Uh, it's special people. It's <laughs> you're not serious. Oh, hey, God. Eric, you're not drinking. Jonathan, I, I'm sorry. Uh, the way I left the other day, I wasn't meant to live that way. I am really sorry. Okay. Nah, it's all right. No need for apologies. I didn't take any offense. Um, Miranda here is going to be my ex-wife very soon, and even though we do have our differences, I, um, I still want us to be friends because she's a good woman, even after divorce. So why do you hate her? Huh? Um, oh, excuse me. <laughs> Chiki! <laughs> Jonathan! What are you doing here? <laughs> you! Well, I came, I came to um, book a spot for a, a, a friend's birthday party. You! You still owe me I one. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Pardon my manners. Uh, these are my friends. This is Miranda and uh, this is Eric. Nice to meet you. Sorry, have we met before? No, not at all. Let me see the manager, I will see you. Okay, no I'm problem, busy. no problem at all. Ooh, this guy, <laughs> bad guy. <laughs> wow. Do you know him? Who? Him? No, no, I don't. So, back to the question. Do you hit her? Uh, <clears throat> Joe, you see? Oh. I'm done. You're leaving. Oh, it's good I to see you to again. My leave now. No oh, problem at all. Nice to meet you guys. Yeah. I hope you're not going to let him drive. Nah, nah, no. Nah. Are you sure? No. Oh, he doesn't look like a guy. Like a guy you drive. You will drive, not me. You are driving, please. Fine. Fine. <laughs> ah, yeah. okay. You know, if we were wise, we should actually stop drinking now. <laughs> well, we are not. <laughs> I 
why don't I just help you up? Okay. Are you sure? What's happening to me? I love Eric. I cannot allow myself to fall for Jonathan. Makes both of us. I did as well. <laughs> I believe this belongs to you. Yes, for me. Thank you. Uh, thank you for tonight. I had a great time. You're most welcome. I had a great time as well. <laughs> yeah. Is Eric sending me? I miss you. Oh, I was wondering. What is going on between you both? Um, <clears throat> what, what do you mean? I mean you and Miranda, what is going on? Because this doesn't look like acting anymore. You guys look like real life couple. Look, I do not know what you're on about, but Miranda and I are just acting. Okay? That's all. You know you're lying. It doesn't look like it. So what is going on? You guys are in love, right? No, we are not in love. We are only acting, okay? Come on, you and I know the kind of lifestyle that Miranda lives. 
She has been with many men. There is no way I'm going to allow myself to fall for her. Look at your eyes. I know exactly when you're lying. I'm your sister. What were you doing on her Instagram page three minutes ago? I see the way you look at her. I see the way you talk to her. I see everything. You just don't want to admit that you're in love with her. I am not in love with her, okay? Yes, I admit that she's quite attractive, but that's all. I don't have any other feelings towards her, okay? Miranda is very loose. And you know your brother, I know better than to associate myself with such a person. She's paying me to do this work and that's all I'm doing, all right? First, I'm not going to allow you to call my friend loose. She's not loose. Then when I'm ready, we can start all this conversation afresh because obviously you're lying. Whatever you say. Yeah, I'm coming. Hold on. Stop crying. Did your husband beat you? Did he hit you? I don't have a husband. I'm not married. Jonathan is not my husband. It was all a ruse. I lied. I lied about everything. I, I paid him. I paid him to act as my soon to be husband because you insisted on wanting to see him. I lied. I don't understand. When the ring you saw in my back the other day, it wasn't actually my wedding ring. I used it to avoid being committed to any man. All I wanted from them was sex. I didn't want to be committed because of what my late mother went through in the hands of my father. Then I met you. I met you and I fell in love with you then. I said to myself that I wasn't going to lose you no matter what. So when you saw the ring, I couldn't bring myself to tell you the truth. I was scared. I was, I was so scared of losing you. I didn't want to lose you. That was why I lied. So you went through all these troubles just because you don't want to lose me? Yes. Rick, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, please. I love you so much. I don't... I'm sorry. I love you too. I love you. to break up with me. No. I even love you, Demo. Let me just explain, please. Please just give me a chance to explain. It's not what you think, all right? I, I, I know I was out of line by saying those things, but please just let me explain, please. Miranda, please, I'm begging you. Just, just give me a second to explain to you. Miranda, please, let me just explain to you, please. Just, just give me a chance to explain to you, please. It's not what you think. I didn't mean it that way. Come on, please. Please. 
I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said those things, but it's, it's, it wasn't the way I meant it. Please, can you just talk to me, say something? Your silence is killing me, please. Miranda, please! You're going out? Yes, I am. Uh, what of uh, Miranda? She's actually off for a meeting. Okay. And um, and Jonathan? He's inside. Okay. You want to see <laughs> yeah, him? Let me see. That's fine. All right. Okay. Okay. Welcome. You're welcome. What's going on? What are you doing here? What? what are you doing? What are you doing? Open that door. What are you doing? What's your problem? What do you want? I just wanted to know that you're the one I really like. You see? I'm so attracted to you. Wait, wait, hold, hold on, I'm confused. What exactly is going on here, right? What are you saying? Jonathan, you... You're the one I like, you're the one I truly love. Go for it. Go for it, Jonathan. Go for it, please. See, you need to leave this room right now. You need to leave me alone! Are you mad?
Jonathan told me what happened. I think I'm cursed. I'm being punished for everything I did in the past. How can you say that? Don't talk like that. Just when I thought I had a chance at love, it turns out there was no love to begin with. My relationship was just a cover-up. Elsie, why can't I be happy? Why can't things just go well? Before now, I was, I was full of so much happiness. I could do anything I wanted without explaining anything to anybody. But just when I decided that I wanted something different, that I wanted to love with all my heart, Kama came knocking. Miranda, challenges is the pathway to our final destination. I believe there is a reason for everything. All we have to do is to find out the reason. And who knows, maybe God has someone special. I'm tired. I am tired of looking for someone. If God truly has someone special, let him locate me himself. Babe, he might be very close, just like you've not figured it out yet. I have nothing to figure out. Elsie, I am tired. All I need is a break. I've been through a lot these past weeks. Maybe love and happiness is not for me. Who knows? No. No. Everyone deserves to be happy. And you will soon, okay? Don't do that. I don't like you being like this, you know it. It's going to be funny, okay? Elsie, you're a good friend. You've been with me through thick and thin. Believe me, I love you so much. I love you too, but where are you going to? I don't deserve you. I don't deserve a good and pure-hearted friend like you. Now you're getting me really confused. What do you mean by you don't deserve me? And where are you going to with your box? I'm leaving. I'm relocating. I can't stay here anymore. I, I don't understand. Like, why? Where are you going to? Um, um, Miranda, did I say anything wrong? I am sorry. Miranda, have I said anything wrong to you? Miranda, Miranda. Babe, did I, babe, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Elsie, please. Elsie, just let me go, please. I just, I can't do this anymore, please. My cab is waiting for me. I can't miss my flight. Yeah, Miranda, Elsie, please. You know please. you're the only one I have. Where are you going to? Do you want to leave me? Elsie, Why are you leaving? Did I do anything? Elsie, I mean, I'm please, sorry. I, beg you, I am please. sorry. Don't go. Don't go. I am sorry. Don't go, please. M Miranda, Miranda, please. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Miranda. If, 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 if I've said anything, I'm sorry. Where is Miranda? She left. She what? She, she left. She left me. Where did I go wrong?
I, I thought you left. I changed my mind. I love you, Miranda. I thought you said you can't love a girl like me. I know, but I was wrong. I was so wrong. I, I love you. I do, and I don't care about your past. What I care about is your future, our future. I want to grow old with you. I want forever with you, Miranda. I love you. I love you too, Jonathan. I love you so much. So, so much. Sure. 